Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is 28th of March 2019 Current Affairs Part 1. Question number 1. What is the theme of the World Metrological Day 2019 celebrations? Option A. Save the Earth. Option B. Earth, Weather, and Water. Option C. The Sun, the Earth and the Weather. Option D. The Sun and the Weather. The correct answer is Option C. The Sun, the Earth and the Weather. Theme of 2019 The Sun, the Earth and the Weather. Question number 2. World Meteorological Day is observed on Option A. The 23rd of March. Option B. The 25th of March. Option C. The 26th of March. Option D. The 27th of March. The correct answer is Option A. The 23rd of March. Every year, on March 23rd, the World Meteorological Organization, WMO, commemorates its founding by observing World Meteorological Day. This year, the organization is celebrating its 69th anniversary. Question number 3. Abhedya training program of Indian Navy was launched in which of the following training facility center? Option A. INS Mandovi. Option B. INS Shivaji. Option C. INS Garuda. Option D. INS Hamla. The correct answer is Option B. INS Shivaji, a nuclear, biological and chemical training facility, NBCETF, called Abhedya was inaugurated by Admiral Sunil Lamba, the Chief of Naval Staff, at INS Shivaji at Lonavla near Pune on the 25th of March 2019. Question number 4. Which of the following country has launched Lose to Win program? Option A. USA. Option B. Germany. Option C. UAE. Option D. Iran. The correct answer is Option C. UAE. In order to help overweight employers, the United Arab Emirates, UAE, government has launched a program that would help them lose weight. According to the WHO figures, obesity rates in the Middle East are exceptionally high with 31.7% prevalence in UAE. The Lose to Win program was launched by the Ministry of Health and Prevention, MOHAP. Question number 5. MSAT satellite is scheduled to be launched on the 1st of April by ISRO. MSAT will be primarily used for which of the following purposes? Option A. Electronic Intelligence Option B. Weather Reporting Option C. Agricultural Monitoring Option D. None of them The correct answer is Option A. Electronic Intelligence Indian Space Research Organization ISRO will launch 29 satellites including the primary payload AMISAT on 1st of April 2019. AMISAT is meant for electromagnetic spectrum measurements. It will be released into an orbit at 749 km. The satellite would serve as the country's roving device for detecting and gathering electronic intelligence from enemy radars across the borders as it circles the globe roughly pole to pole every 90 minutes or so. Question number 6. First Indian Army mountaineering expedition to world's fifth highest peak was flagged off on the 26th of March 2019. The fifth highest mountain peak is Option A. Lusa. Option B. Makalu. Option C. Dholagiri. Option D. Annapurna. The correct answer is Option B. Makalu.
First Indian Army Mountaineering Expedition to Mount Makalu, 8,485 meters, comprising five officers, two JCOs and eleven or was flagged off by Director General Military Training on the 26th of March 2019. Mount Makalu is considered amongst the most dangerous peaks and summiting the peak is considered extremely challenging due to inclement weather conditions and freezing temperatures. Makalu is the fifth highest mountain in the world at 8,485 meters. Question number 7. Which of the following Indian Institute is currently testing a floating device that can generate electricity from flowing surface water of rivers and streams? Option A. IIT Bombay. Option B. IIT Madras. Option C. IIT Roorkee. Option D. ISK Bangalore. The correct answer is Option C. IIT Roorkee. Scientists at IIT Roorkee are testing a floating device that can generate electricity from flowing surface water of rivers and streams, paving the way for an alternative source of renewable energy. Question number 8. Renowned writer Krishlan Sobhati who recently passed away is best known for her outstanding contribution in which of the following languages literature? Option A. Malayalam. Option B. Hindi. Option C. Tamil. Option D. Manipuri. The correct answer is Option B. Hindi. Renowned writer Krishna Sobhati died at the age of 93. She was famously known for her outstanding contribution in the Hindi literature. Question number 9. Which Reserve Bank of India has recently imposed a penalty of 2 crore on which bank? Option A. Yes Bank. Option B. Kanara Bank. Option C. Bank of Baroda. Option D. Punjab National Bank. The correct answer is. Option D. Punjab National Bank. Reserve Bank of India. RBI, recently imposed a fine of 2 crore on Punjab National Bank for violating the rules of the global messenger software SWIFT. Question number 10. Which app has been launched by the CBSE board to keep students and parents updated with all the necessary information? Option A. Shiksha Vikas. Option B. Shiksha Vani. Option C. Shiksha Update. Option D. Teacher Shiksha. The correct answer is Option B. Shikshavani. CBSE board recently launched a podcast app Shikshavani to keep students and parents updated with all the necessary information. This podcast app will give people necessary information related to academic, training and examinations. Question number 11. Like Netflix and Amazon Prime Video, which company has launched its own video streaming service? Option A. Flipkart. Option B. Walmart. Option C. Apple. Option D. Google. The correct answer is. Option C. Apple. Like Netflix and Amazon Prime Video, Apple has recently launched its own video streaming service Apple TV Plus service. Apple TV Plus is a subscription-based video service, in which the user can only see Apple original show. Question number 12. Which space agency with a laser device will be sent along with Chandrayaan-2, India's second mission on the moon? Option A. ESA. Option B. Bhabha. Option C. NASA. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option C. NASA, a laser device of NASA from America's space agency NASA along with India's second mission Chandrayaan-2 will also be sent to the moon. This NASA device will detect the distance between the Earth and the moon. Question number 13. 
In how many minutes have India recently dropped the satellite into the low orbit in space? Option A. 2 minutes. Option B. 3 minutes. Option C. 5 minutes. Option D. 7 minutes. The correct answer is Option B. 3 minutes. India has recently demolished the satellite in low Earth orbit in space for 3 minutes. This achievement has made India the fourth country in the world. With this achievement, India has registered its name in the form of Space Mahashakti, Space Power. Question number 14. Which State Chief Minister Pradeep Savant has removed Deputy Chief Minister Mr. Sudhin Dhavlakara from the post? Option A. Punjab. Option B. Gujarat. Option C. Goa. Option D. Kerala. The correct answer is Option C. Goa. Goa Chief Minister Pradeep Savant recently removed Deputy Chief Minister Sadin Dhavalikar from the post. Pandit is MLA of Maharashtravadi Gomantak Party, MGP, who has merged with BJP. Question number 15. How many meters air pistol mixed team events in Manu Bhakya and Saurabh Chaudhary won gold medal in the 12th Asian Air Gun Championship? Option A. 5 meters. Option B. 10 meters. Option C. 15 meters. Option D. 20 meters. The correct answer is Option B. 10 meters. In the 12th Asian Air Gun Championship, Indian shooter Manu Bhakra and Saurabh Chaudhary have recently won gold medal in the 10 meter air pistol mixed team event. This pair of India secured first place with 484.8 points in the finals of five teams. Question number 16. Which Sri Lankan cricket recently has allowed the entire match to be played in IPL? Option A. Dinesh Chandimal. Option B. Disara Parera. Option C. Lasith Malinga. Option D. Upul Tharanga. The correct answer is Option C. Lasith Malinga. Sri Lanka cricket has recently allowed fast bowler Lasith Malinga to play the entire match in the IPL. According to Chris Info's report, SLC had recently said that it will be necessary for Sri Lankan players to play in their domestic provincial tournaments to play in the World Cup. Question number 17. Which of the following scooters has become the first scooter in the country to cross the 20 million mark? Option A. Hero Pleasure. Option B. Honda Activa. Option C. Yamaha Fashino. Option D. Dream Yuga. The correct answer is Option B. Honda Activa. Recently Honda's Honda Activa scooter has become the first scooter in the country to cross the 2 million mark. Providing its services to five generations in the last 18 years, Activa has become the first choice for Indian two-wheelers. Question number 18. Which country has successfully tested anti-ICBM system from Marshall Island? Option A. Japan. Option B. China. Option C. Australia. Option D. America. The correct answer is Option D. America. The US has successfully tested the anti intercontinental ballistic missile, ICBM, system system from Marshall Island recently. This system is designed to burn the interceptor missile in space. Question number 19. India and which country have recently had a settlement for multinational companies? Option A. China. Option B. America. Option C. Australia. Option D. Iraq. The correct answer is. Option B. America. Recently, 
Intergovernmental agreement for multinationals has been settled between India and the United States. This agreement will facilitate the exchange of country by country, CBC, reports between the two countries. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonderslate app now, link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.